The Keweenaw County Jail is 130 years old and is now likely seeing its final days as a jailhouse. The County Board of Commissioners recently voted to change the operations of the facility from a jail to a 72-hour lockup. Keweenaw County Sheriff Ron Lottie called it an end of an era. It's a tough thing for me because I fought since 1993 to keep our jail. It, you know, it got tough at times. There were a lot of hours involved, but it wasn't about, it was about keeping Keweenaw County's identity is how I looked at it. In 1997, an addition was built to house an increasing number of inmates at the jail, but those days are over. We are housing at one point five and six inmates per day on average for the year. And, uh, you know, my wife and I uh, lived here for many, many years and operated the jail as kind of a, a family-run operation, kind of. Her and I would, you know, she did the cooking and the taking care of answering phones and, and taking care of inmates' issues, which kept the cost down. The layoff of two full-time corrections officers and another part-time employee is expected to save the county upwards of $100,000 a year in staffing costs. Inmates will instead be housed at the Houghton County Jail. This will be an awesome 72-hour lockup facility. It'll work really great for the county. Anybody arrested here will still come here. If they can't post-bond, they can't for whatever reason, either they don't have the money or the bond is too high or the judge refuses bond, after three days they'll be moved to a, a different facility. The changes become effective April 1st. For ABC 10 CW5 News, I'm Keweenaw Bureau reporter Rick Allen.